liver it's a very important organ of our body its function is to make hormones to build the immunity and to develop our body and to filter the bad stuff from our body and also helps in digestion but what happens is because of our eating habits our liver's function is mainly only on digestion it's all focus is in digesting the stuff in removing the bad stuff from our body and while doing these functions other functions as working on the hormones as building our immunity and developing our body these functions of the liver are left behind so it's very important to keep our liver healthy if you want good skin if you want good eyesight if you want to live long if you want good hair if you want good hormones in all of these you need to have good liver liver is not only an organ it is an gland now what's the difference see glands are the organs which makes hormones as i told liver also makes hormone conversion of t4 to t3 happens in liver estrogen is balanced by the liver androgen hormones in males and females in everybody it's balanced by liver now what are the signs that our liver is not healthy if you are having severe hair fall your hair are not good then this means you have to take care of your liver only treating your hair is not going to help because breakdown of keratin and absorption of all the vitamins and minerals and keratin is gonna happen because of liver if your eyes are weak this means your vitamin a and vitamin d are gone you are finished with vitamin a and vitamin d now from where this vitamin a and vitamin d comes they comes from the food that you eat but absorption of these vitamins happens because of liver because liver secretes bile and this bile helps in breakdown of the fat that gets in your body from the food that you are eating and these vitamins vitamin a vitamin d vitamin e vitamin k are fat soluble vitamins and that's why liver is needed in breakdown of these getting these vitamins from the food that you are eating and absorption so your liver should be functioning good if you want to have good eyesight now as i have talked about vitamin a d e and k these are linked with your skin also which are the most important vitamins for our skin it's vitamin a vitamin e vitamin e capsules everyone tells even i tell and my diys why because it's good for your skin but what about inside how your body is going to get these vitamins from the food that you are eating again the story comes to liver so liver helps in absorption of these vitamins from the food that you are eating only putting the vitamin e capsules on your diys and applying on your skin is not going to happen you have to get it from the food that you are eating if you are having dry skin eczema lots of dots chicken skin it's deficiency of vitamin a why you are having deficiency of vitamin a it's not only because your food is lacking in vitamin a it is because your body is not able to absorb vitamin a and vitamin e from the food that you are eating so focus inside your body even if you are having bad breath your tongue is not clean these are the signs that your liver is not functioning good how our liver became unhealthy because we made it unhealthy by making wrong food choices if you are eating more chips if you are eating fast food if you are eating fried food these things are gonna create damage and your liver will be focused only and removing these bad stuff from your body and will be fatigued and as the liver is fatigued you are going to have skin issues you are going to have problems with your hormones and this can lead to further severe health issues if a person is not eating on time these all things are going to affect the health of the liver so these are the reasons why we have problems with our liver now how to treat our liver very simple just give time to your liver and it's gonna regenerate liver has this power even if it's cut to half it can regrow again yes it's so magical organ the only thing is don't eat again and again means small small snack whole of the day don't do it give your body time especially at night eat on time at night gets time to regenerate gets time to repair this is very important at least 12 to 14 hours give your body without food in this time you can drink only water 
no tea no coffee nothing this is very important practice it every single day and you are going to see that your liver will be getting healthy slowly slowly food choices you have to get more potassium potassium is gonna heal your liver from where to get potassium i will recommend to eat more salads more vegetables from there you are going to get lots of potassium if you have gas bloating after this just drink apple cider vinegar one tablespoon in a glass of warm water and drink it this will balance the ph of your stomach and you are not going to have gas and bloating after you eat lots of salad the herb that is gonna help you is bhumi amlaki I love this herb for liver I have seen lots of health benefits of using this herb tremendous herb start using it if you are new start with half teaspoon for five to seven days and then go for one teaspoon half teaspoon in the morning half teaspoon in the evening empty stomach this is how i recommend use of bhumi amlaki for five to seven days after this go for one teaspoon in the morning one teaspoon in the evening also empty stomach but if you feel that you're not comfortable empty stomach then you can go 30 minutes after food but first try to take it empty stomach and you are going to see magics happening in ayurveda the holistic medical science people are using this herb for more than 5000 years it is time tested it has been tested by me by myself i love this herb tremendous herb for liver start using it at least for three months you have to use it and then have a gap of a month and then again you can start but i think if you'll eat lots of salad and you will eat right you'll give your body time three months are going to be enough if you're having too much of fat then you have to give yourself at least a year and this you have to eat bhumiyam like in this way like three months then a gap of a month and then again use it so this is how you use bhumi amlaki tremendous herb but make it clear that only this herb is not going to work you have to give yourself time again and again i'm saying this eat on time in the evening give your body a good gap of 12 to 14 hours minimum and then have your next meal eat more vegetables this is important apple cider vinegar is also awesome i have told you how to use it so do all these things you are going to see results i hope this video will be helpful for you see you in the next video with a big smile smile more stay happy stay healthy